Yeah, let me talk about that really quick. So if you are done, if we're looking at the agenda, if you are done with the capitalization practice number one and practice number two in No Red Ink, and you've taken the capitalization quiz, and you've made sure you have no zeros in the grade book, you are good to go. You may leave the meat. Um, if you have not done those, that's what you're doing today, okay? Let me remind you, uh, so if, you're, if you've done the quiz and you've already finished it, you're good to go. But if you have not done it, let me remind you that the capitalization quiz on No Red Ink is due today, no later than 3 o'clock. Just take it right now. Take it during our class time. Don't wait because after 3 o'clock, you automatically begin losing 10% every day. And you do not want to lose those points. Just take it now. It would be better to take it now, get it over with, get the grade that you're going to get without getting any deductions. Okay. Um, I've been lenient on all the other assignments with being late. You can turn in anything you have a zero in because we're doing the distance learning. Um, we're also a reminder that we are going to be on a B schedule when we come back. So I'll see half of you all on Monday, uh, in school, the other half will still be online. Okay. So, uh, if you have questions about no re red ink or any of the topics, now is the time to ask. Uh, before I kind of release you all. So if there's a topic on either practice one or practice two that you want to talk about, speak up right now and I can go over them. So any of those that you want to talk about, let me know. Also, if you're about to take the quiz, uh, it is open book. So you are more than welcome to use your notes or Google stuff or think about it because you can do that in your writing. And that's a skill we want you to work on is using your notes, using um, your, uh, resources. Okay. Now, obviously you can't sit there with a parent or a brother or sister or a classmate and take it. Um, you know, they can't help you on that, but you can use your own resources to do that. So, um, I'm going to go into student mode and give you all a few minutes, go look and, you know, so Calvization, uh, practice, uh, one and two is available. Uh, if you want me to go over any of the topics. So I'll give you all a second to think about, are there any topics you want me to go over? Um, if I don't hear anything from you guys, and I'll turn the chat back on for now. So if you want to write in the chat, like, do you want to go over uh, the political, how to capitalize politics, uh, political positions? If you want to talk about family members, if you want to talk about titles, short form, long form, any of that, here's your opportunity. So I'll give you all about a, a minute to respond to that. Here's a look at all the, the different topics. We got capitalizing formatting, it's long form versus short form, pronouns. I don't know why I can't see practice two, but practice two covers um, day, uh, days and months, it covers family titles, it covers political, it covers uh, cities and streets. Um, any of that you want covered. All right, I'll take that as a, uh, you guys are ready to go. So you are welcome to jump off the Google Meet and uh, go over, double check, make sure no one responds. Yeah, go over to the No Red Ink quiz, take that quiz. Um, if you have a question, then uh, I will be on Go uh, Google Meet, but otherwise you can ask in, um, Go Guardian, and uh, I'll be able to take individual questions. Obviously, I won't be able to help you on the quiz necessarily, but if it's a generalized question, I, I can, or a I don't understand question, you can ask that. So, good luck and uh, have a wonderful fall break. Um, and I will be available for the rest of the class period if you need me. Thank you.